Hey guys, before we begin, I just wanted to remind you that I'm going to be doing renders of each and every character that appears in Death Battle for at least this season, sort of as a way to celebrate the 10th anniversary. I'm going to be releasing these on my DeviantArt, but they won't be there immediately after the reaction goes up. But I'll leave a link in the description to my DeviantArt so you can wait for them there. But without further ado, let's jump right in. Hello everyone and everywhere, whoever was or will be, I am Red Runner, and today I am joined by Gumball Viking and Hyper Starman. And your voice is glitching out. Awesome introduction. You, Gumball, start. Gumball, that's on Discord. I'm telling you, my uh, yeah, microphone know, doesn't pick up any of that <laughs> uh, Alright, but uh, I'm still hearing it. That's just what I'm saying, man. Anyways, right. <laughs> I'm really happy to be here. Normally, I would crack some jokes, make embarrassment of myself, you know, the huge. But oh, you still will. This is just, <laughs> yeah, I, I'm still going to, but I want to take things a bit more seriously this time. Yeah. Which is awfully ironic because it's freaking Steven versus Star, but, you know, <laughs> there's just so much I've already talked about. On Nemesis's prediction, which I'm pretty sure you guys won't watch, but I'm going to link it in the comment section anyway. <laughs> This is an episode that means a lot to me and to Hyper, and especially to Red. Yeah. And... Mm -hmm. It's just exciting uh, that it's just... happening. <laughs> Basically. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, I... I already discussed yeah. it in my top ten video, and I imagine you discussed it in Nemesis's um, prediction. But no, we didn't talk about Steven versus Star at all in the Steven versus Star prediction. Exactly. No, I think you get what I'm getting at. For those of you who aren't aware, uh, although you probably should have watched the episode by now, so hopefully you will be aware, Star is more powerful than a lot of people seem to expect. Yeah, there was like lots of history. Everyone yeah. thought that Steven just had this oh he could just tank everything look at all these cool powers he has who cares that star literally has a green lantern in the form of a wand uh steven can turn pink and um as it turns out being able to do any and everything is a lot better than turning into strawberry milk donk and rapa juice colors i'll i'll be honest with you though i'll be honest with you though Honestly, I feel like people at the same exact time overestimate how much Star is capable of, because, and I don't want to understate it, but she doesn't use the majority of hacks that she theoretically can. She has a very limited array of moves that she clearly knows. And most of them are just All right, but punching you really yeah. hard. I mean, like, <laughs> why, but why bother with that when you have narwhals? That why, is my yeah, question yeah, to just, you. Just use narwhals. Yeah, but uh, I'd like to uh, take it from here. All right. But uh, yeah, um, hey, yeah, me and this Anne Castle were on the blog again. Uh, was fun, and uh, we basically came to the conclusion that it wasn't a debate if Steven versus on who would win Steven versus Star. It was a debate for the longest time if Star had any disadvantages in the entire thing, and I wish I was joking. <laughs> and, and, and there was the even bigger debate of will this be worse than Ben versus Hal in terms of reception? And I think it, it, thanks to the blog's comments, we got our answer. Yeah. So look forward to that, Nemesis. Um, <laughs> that was very very fun to look at uh right. i am just dying to just look at. i can't one, wait so. for all the re other reactors to look at that one <laughs> sandcastle like huh that's a weird shape <laughs> then think I nothing better, of it i hope one of them calls it a tomato yeah, that doesn't I'm going no to one kill will you. no one will call it to okay now someone's going to call it a tomato but <laughs> but what if what if <laughs> you, you never know. know you never know they could be racist <laughs> Okay, but anyway, uh, I agree. I agree. Hey, you guys want to talk about actual stats now? Yeah, I agree with the assertion that Star is more powerful and more than likely more durable. You can make a glass cannon argument. It doesn't make much sense, though, because she fights people on par with herself and tanks their hits. Speaking of the glass cannon argument, have you seen all those people who are like, oh, Star will only win if they scale her to the wand. Every time I see that argument, I can just see, you have not fucking watched the show. She literally <laughs> loses like, her wand. She basically... <laughs> 
Lindsay. No, yeah, no, I say, I say loses. I say loses, but she she gives her wand up because she doesn't need it anymore. Yeah, and like, yeah, because yeah, like when because like Glossark literally says dipping down unlocks the full potential of her magic, which is implied to be even more powerful without the wand. So that's actually a disadvantage for Steven. Yeah, if they I, just, I would. I feel like Star, that's. I I've taught you everything I know. Now all you need to do is master the yoinky sploinky, and you will have everything <laughs> you need. For real, though. I feel like that is overstating it, but she's definitely just as powerful with or without the wand. <laughs> I don't think she's more powerful because she's not using the wand. Uh, oh, yeah, and off topic. Remember when Origin did the animation for that on his channel? His first that was, one? That was and badass. He even one. That and was guess great. what? And guess what? Yeah, he's cool. animating this one. <laughs> yeah, he's the reason that yeah. I'm a sandcastle for some reason. So, <laughs> and Red's there, too. I'm and there, too. Maybe I'm if, there. If, I don't, if I don't notice Bas that, basically, if I don't notice that, by the way, immediately, just scream it at me. <laughs> Because basically, sure, well, we will shout tell out you. to or shout out to Oregon. That's... He recently just did his first episode of Iron Fist versus Poe, and he's just <laughs> one of the best animators I've seen in a long time. And that's <laughs> not just because I know him personally, but, but he's yeah. also you know just a cool person. He's really cool. Right, right. Uh, we're just we're just uh, yeah. Origin's nice. You know, how about anyway, we just, how that's, we that's if I don't. About that's if, Star? that is if I don't notice. By the way. I don't just scream oh. it at me if I do. <laughs> uh, Alright, All right. hey, since spot, you're the so one yeah. in charge of the video, you have to say the might get it right thing. Uh, I mean, your, I will. This no. is your, I will, no. but we're not done. No. We're not your done. Burden to bear. Okay, the one, thing I dis <laughs> the one thing I disagree with the blog on is Star's speed. None of the arguments make very much sense. In my opinion, it's either scaling. Her Honestly, to I have to agree. It's because, either like, scaling. You hear all these speed yeah. feats, and then I'm just like, wait. They they make portals all the time. <laughs> yeah, they there are well, por there are portals that are made. Others are scaling to magical attack speed, which I don't have any reason to scale to their reactions because clearly spells are very different speeds across all of them. And then lastly yeah, like, is scaling to omni the, the rainbow is cannon, shrinking. The rainbow cannon one, she explicitly states it has stuff in it. It's not made of light. So, yeah. but. The last one is scaling to Omnitrax is growing and shrinking, which is making a giant assumption that he is the literal size of a galaxy, which I don't like. <laughs> uh, do we have anything else to say? That's pretty much it. Save the world. We didn't. Uh, we didn't mention any. We didn't mention Good any point. of what the actual feats are. But I don't know if I even want to. <laughs> I mean, like, if they saw the if they saw the prediction and they saw how much I got wrong, they should be, you know, cautiously optimistic. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, yeah. Like, uh, I guess. Uh, there, I guess like quick thing. Uh, there's like a star. There's like the the like the diamonds made a diamond blast that like generates lights that gets like to s dwarf star to solar oh, system. Uh, and yeah, then... we have to make the joke. You know, we have to make it. <laughs> oh yeah, no, no, they, no, yeah. Gonna... Pre no, we don't. We don't. Need, they we have don't a dwarf see... star. Hyper, Hyper dwarf shut star. up. Listen, listen. We don't need to make the joke. They're gonna make it for us. Bet. They, they are. are they they probably so are. It's, it's star uh, level universe versus universe level star. <laughs> also, yeah, it. Star's ancestor blew up a universe. <laughs> I, I haven't mentioned accident. that yet in that's, this video. That's more chemistry than that's more chemistry than any boyfriend Star has had. <laughs> Don't ask me. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Look, I anyway, a joke other than genocide. <laughs> anyway, I think I think uh, that's about it. Steven has some massively uh, faster than light stuff that I think yeah. makes him faster, but it doesn't matter. Star's gonna win anyway. All right. Steven's going to be like, man, I just wanted to build tank castles. And Star's going to be like, you have mere seconds to live. But hey, it's not mm -hmm. up to us. It's up to these guys. And we might get it right. We might get it wrong. I don't know. But either We're way. We're going to get it right. I have insider knowledge. Let's start our show. <laughs> oh, boy. The bane of Lily Orchard's existence. <laughs> Uh, listen, you really don't have to. <laughs> we already got a tab. Spoilers. Spoilers. The shows have been over. <laughs> I mean, fair enough, but still. <laughs> yeah, like. <it's... laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Steven just uppercutted her. 
for their own game. Uh, just so you know, the audio network track for the trailer for the next time is called In It to Win It. Ah. <laughs> uh, this is interesting. One comment I will yeah, make. I'm so giddy seeing them talk about this. It's minor. So weird. It's minor, but the audio coming through the stream is a little bit weird. I don't care yeah, that much. Fine. I don't care much. I'm just mentioning. To which the three diamonds of the authority responded by trying to destroy every gem left on Earth. Yep. Uh, that sounds mm. like overkill. <laughs> collapse of light, every gem was corrupted or destroyed. She managed to defend them all with her shield. And one other that was stuck in the ground, but... And she, immediately geez, why is, starts the count. Why so quickly? We haven't even introduced who the f*** Steven is. Uh, <laughs> we don't I guess need to. just like going from... They're going from feats, like, from the past to present, I guess? Mm. I like still it. remember it's that a, one thing, like, I format. can't believe you gave up your life for sex, Rose. Shit, Pearl, it was worth it. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> this really does sound so much like Steven Universe he, music. He is a talented ukulele player. He really is. I mean, his dad's a musician, literally, what do you expect? Alright, but he was, like, literally in his diapers when he invented the theme song. When they inevitably return. Nightmare <laughs> Hospital, go to terrifying episode, please watch it. It wasn't that scary, but... Yeah. <laughs> I'd never... Yeah, like, if you play games like Resident Evil and Silent Hill, then you're gonna be like, oh, that's baby stuff, but, like, for a kid's show... <laughs> no, we don't need to know. <laughs> uh, they better not fuse, I swear to god. Yeah, you're right. You wouldn't be And yeah, Steven can't use it because it's outside help, yeah. Well yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's an understatement. He can his watermelon self. Can he? I don't think he can. Well, I know he never has. Theoretically, maybe he could, but... <laughs> Why are you going to bring up the laser things? Like, there's so much... Because they're going to bring up everything. They haven't brought up how fast the Diamond Blast was, for instance. Another gem he's on par with, Lapis, telekinetically lifted... My god, Lapis. there are so many calcs! Jesus. <laughs> Look at all these <laughs> numbers! No, do you know how heavy the ocean is? The effort ocean mode! Anywhere from 92 petatons to over 10 zetatons... They're also way stronger than they look, since they're mm. defend against attacks from the diamonds themselves! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> look at him totally take this attack, he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> Humanoid form. Just spitting out seeds from a watermelon has gotten Steven in quite a bind before. <laughs> <laughs> That's not gonna pop up and attack me, is it? No, Boomstick. Regular watermelons don't attack people. Uh, yeah. Emotional state. He has very. That you know. Plant-based life form. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <laughs> you gonna eat that? <laughs> <laughs> I love that. That was actually a tear, but. Turn pink and have powers of their own after. Despite not being one to pursue conflict, Steven's been stuck for a while making the best of carrying on Rose's duty around him. It's the complete opposite of what Rose did. I mean, you're right, but also we don't need to. We don't need to do that to her. And when Steven's knocked down, he can leave his physical body sort of like anything while he's projecting. But when Steven goes to sleep normally, he can possess other people's bodies. Good luck trying to fall asleep in a fight, though. <laughs> yeah. I mean, he, yeah. Fell, he fell asleep while the entire Earth was shaking, but... He was never actually quartz at all. She was, in fact, Pink Diamond. And everyone hated it. <laughs> <laughs> Most people expected it, but then they stopped expecting it, and then when it was the truth, they hated it. <laughs> All of this was withheld from Stephen for most of his life, as Pearl <laughs> worried how the truth might change him. Oh, believe me, parental trauma will take a toll on anyone's mental state. Oh, not again. When Stephen gets too overwhelmed, he taps into his latent diamond abilities, making everything way stronger. <laughs> way killier. Very, very killier. You're right, Jasper. I have been holding back. <laughs> ...and strong enough to crush other gems. 
like when he lost control of his emotions in a fight with Jasper and killed her. He yeah. Bring her back to life with his super yeah, that happened. But that kind of stuff made him think he was a monster, and he basically turned into a pink state Godzilla. But this wasn't Steven hulking out all of a sudden. It was the result of a full emotional breakdown after years of stress and trauma. Yeah. Which I'm pretty sure Star is going to do to her immediately. Yeah. I don't want that to show up in the episode, but mm, maybe. I think I wanted to. It would be cool. I, w I want I want Steven to have the cluster help him out. Well, no, that's just not going to happen. <laughs> yeah, I know, but it would be cool. Of course, mm. if it was up to Steven Universe, everyone would just be friends. <laughs> As the perfect transition. <laughs> oh, Famine, God, pestilence, that's actually and the best Steven. transition they could have chosen. I mean, student at his school, he thought he was just making a new friend from a different place. And he definitely who drag him along for all of her crazy adventures. Fuck you, ponyhead. Girl from you what was a little weird and a little wild. And on top of bringing magic to Earth, she might have brought along a few extras as well. I feel sorry yeah. for all the Star Butterfly fans who never saw Steven Universe because she's the only reason that she's going to be in death battle. Alright, you said she, but yeah. Oh, what is this music? That's interesting. Full like... name of Star Butterfly the Underestimated. <laughs> I, ne I never knew that. But luckily, Star's parents took one yep, look at that every single one of the queens got a subtitle. You know, Earth really isn't Wait. the best place for her to be pregnant. Oh, God. <laughs> God, remember the, like, the first couple episodes when she was literally just an idiot? <laughs> she literally <Yeah>. killed people. She survived a blast that leveled the top of Castle Muni. Oh, yeah, we're getting right into it here, too. Give it to uh, Listen. <laughs> Those wings are so useless. <laughs> that spell book that she never paid attention to. Oh my god, they better not run into laser puppies. We don't need those things. Uh, hey, there's what? the one where she turns the planet. Yeah, Star doesn't know any of the spells in the book except for, like, one. <laughs> uh, the ones she's read, basically. Starfish Tsunami? What the hell are these? She really has only read like three of them, if that. Well, they're kind of self explanatory, creating her own Warnicorn Stampy of the zoo, only one that she knows that she likes using. So, what happens when you combine unicorn stampede war? Ah, yeah, speaking of which. Yeah, her most... Self-professed most powerful summon. With his yeah. Bullshit. Well, it just doesn't make any sense, and also he's dead. <laughs> uh, we'll <laughs> get, get to that. <laughs> Genocide. <laughs> they never named out the Narol Blast zero out of ten. Her mother even said her wand could blow up a universe. And one of her Oh, they're doing it. <laughs> I mean, yeah. And there it is. Skywind wanted to make something explode one day. Why not an entire dimension? Nice. Skywind recorded her experience. Yep. Take that, Reddit. Also wanted to destroy a dimension. So Star should be able to do this since she's known to be a strong person on top of the air to the butterfly. They I thought yeah. they would mention that in the post analysis, but they mentioned it. Nah, that's immediate. <laughs> Bruh, how do you even We're think Steven wins after you just you know hear that shit? That Steven is fucking dead. <laughs> yeah. Star has spells for more than just destruction, though. Like her oh, I forgot she actually used that laser, yeah. Catch up the cars. And one of the monsters she's fought, Meteora, has deflected lightning. Being able to okay. with Meteora means Star's able to reach speeds over Mach 1000. But if all that wasn't enough for you, Star went through mute. That seems pretty bare. <laughs> We're not quite done. powerful butterfly form. That's a set of wings. I just wish peering into her eyes wasn't like peering into the nine layers of hell. Star compared the process of attaining it to, quote, suddenly looking at boys as if they were made of bacon. Like you've That's weird. In your life, and all you want to eat is bacon. 
So what you're saying is Oh no. Oh okay. <laughs> I thought it was going somewhere else. <laughs> <laughs> the, not the best joke, but not the worst. Can destroy planets with mega explosive crystal laser. What? <laughs> what? what? It, yeah, she has a spell like that. No, mega explosive crystal laser. I didn't know that could destroy planets. Or season four. <laughs> realized in order to truly quell the conflict she needed to fight magic itself that that seems like a very large leap in logic the realm of magic it destroyed magic itself all of it yeah doesn't that mean she killed all the magical creatures across the different dimensions because they need magic to survive? Yeah, we don't talk about that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> they tried their best to they tried their best to sugarcoat it, but uh, that's the appropriate answer. Mostly. Now <laughs> truly grown from her chrysalis into a butterfly. <laughs> Wow, the differences in transitions are oh, God. insane. <laughs> okay, Jesus. Then. Just so you know, that was for a school event. Yeah. What? All right. Yeah, we're skipping the ad. I mean, we can pause it right now. What? No, no, that's not. There's no 650. ad. Six hundred fifty. Six. Yeah, six hundred fifty. Right. That's a running joke. It's sorry. Also, the map from Overwatch. <laughs> Does that mean Star's gonna get play of the game? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no! What happened? What is that castle? You cannot fix it, Star. Give it back and dad up. Aww. <laughs> okay, I think I have a better idea. <laughs> 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 I just there you go. Wow. Oh, right, With the Red. big Keep old your smile out. on her face. That's not Keep your eyes out. Keep your eyes out for the sand castles. <laughs> the sand castle. The all right, sand castles. and we're just getting right into this. Or okay, right okay, now, right, right, now. right there. Right there, right there. What? You, it. <laughs> you missed it. God, how is it that fast? <laughs> nah, hyper back up. <laughs> <laughs> no, we'll just wait until we're done. Nah, Hyper, back up! <laughs> Whatever. Oh, I love this fight already. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. They're just fighting on the rainbow. And I love the music. <laughs> oh, right. Take your time. Wait, stars. <laughs> Star, don't Star, kill don't them! don't kill them. <laughs> don't kill them. I understand what season 4 did Oof. to you, but I know you could do better, please. <laughs> Wait, really? Wait, really? What? We're jumping right into uh, it. Why not? <laughs> I'm a little uh, okay. This sure. is fast. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> uh oh. What's wrong with you? Just leave me. Oh god. Super Whoa. Saiyan. Whoa. <laughs> Wait, what? Okay. Whoa. Hi, Swan. <laughs> 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 this animation is amazing. I just love all the Easter eggs that you got yeah. into it. <laughs> oh god, they're making time slow oh, around geez. them. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. My god. <laughs> Wow, they're really oh, good. Oh, at least get some good is, hits in. This is really good looking. Oh god. <laughs> Oof. They really wanted. They really wanted Steven to do some damage. Never surrender. <laughs> <laughs> is that Liam? Liam said he yeah, had he some lines. Yeah, yeah, that is Liam. What is she doing? She can just portal. Oh god. She doesn't need to do that. <laughs> okay. Hey. Oh, there we go. Oh, is that it? Ooh! Uh, that's it. Huh. Number one victory, Roy Gal. I won! Alright. 
Mm. That was uh, right. that, that honestly felt like really everyone. that honestly felt really fast. It did. I expected it to be longer. <laughs> <laughs> he did. <laughs> I kind of wish Steven did more though. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I really hope that you can do more Steven Universe in Death Battle. It's always great. <laughs> and honestly, I feel like I this was a decent would do a lot more to me. The sprites were amazing. I loved it. The sprites were good. Honestly, it was just a lot faster than I thought it should have been. <laughs> if yeah. I'm being real. Wow, they really low their steeds, huh? Mm. Yeah. As far as we know, but yes. It is possible Steven could match the power of the diamond tree. And yeah, her magic's durability should be equal to its attack potential. Yeah. That's what they just brought up. Interesting Steven was too innocent for death battle. Yeah. In interestingly, they didn't bring up any of the, like, ridiculous speed feats, but yeah. Oh, she- they did it. They did it. <laughs> yeah, there you go. They did it. <laughs> oh, I didn't actually notice that during that, like, death scream of Steven's, his gem cracked in half. Yeah. Interesting. Uh, get ready for the backlash, everyone. This'll be fun. Uh, that'll be fun. Anyways, oh boy, was I can't wait Was that a shorter episode than normal? <laughs> Probably. Really, the analysis was long, but the, the hell felt short. What is this, anyways? Oh god! Oh, oh, okay. oh shit! <laughs> Really? We're getting now? right into this. All the confirmed characters of the first half? Really? Yeah, all of them. Alright then. And that's my birthday. You know, it was another happy episode birth in... Happy birthday. You're going to see Legend of Zelda get zero wins on this show. <laughs> that's fine. We'll see. I'm curious how they update Cloud, because this is going to be a very important episode for Final Fantasy. Now so, I like, to... being unbiased here... There was a lot of stuff I loved, and there was a lot of stuff where I really question it. <laughs> like, the fight went by way too fast. <laughs> yeah. Being completely honest. I, I'll probably want to watch this one on its own as well as... Oh, by the way, I should mention I was a lot more fond of Iron Fist vs. Poe on a rewatch, but I probably will have to do the same for this fight. Yeah, Either I usually, way. I usually have I usually have negative first impressions, but there was <laughs> lots of stuff that I really loved here on a first go around. Yeah. I think my expectations were like insanely high since I was in the episode and I just mm -hmm. really wanted it to be the new favorite of the show. And like there's lots of good stuff here, but there's also lots of stuff that doesn't really work out. Mm -hmm. Like I said before, I'm basically repeating myself at this point, but it went by way too fast, and I think that not enough stuff on Steven's side was shown off. I need to rewatch this again. They actually they showed a decent amount. They showed a decent amount. They showed a decent amount of his powers. The only thing that I didn't really, really notice explicitly was floating. But like, do you really expect that? <laughs> I guess, but like, I love the dialogue. I think it was hilarious. <laughs> All right, pause it, man. Yeah. Uh, I just want to. I'm just gonna watch this on my own now because yeah. I want to see. All right, then mute yourself so that me and uh, can or, or talk just, like the big no, boys. No, not disable the live stream. That's all. But either way, yeah. Overall, it it was fun. Um, and like they it. they didn't give yeah. either of them their ridiculous speed feats. They potentially could have, but eh. Uh, they didn't even mention either of them. Now that I think about it. All right, Red, I'm going to PM this to you because I literally just saw this in the first spoiler chat. You need to put this up on the screen. <laughs> oh, no. What did, you, All right, what did you see? All right, I... I'm going to PM it to you too, Hyper. Here, look. What? Anyway, yes, keep, someone keep, did keep, it already. And keep, I feel like they could... I've said it several times. I feel like they could have given them some of their faster than light feats. I know Star has faster than light feats. I just don't agree with the super high-end ones. 
I I just hope that we get more Steven Universe and Death Battle. They are it's a goaded series. I understand there's lots of flack behind it, but <laughs> Please watch it. Form and, your own opinion. And I'll mention, I'm glad that they didn't do the kaiju, Steven. It didn't matter to the fight, and I felt like it would be a little bit insensitive if they did. <laughs> so, anything else to add? Link vs. Cloud, uh, that was on, I mean, that I was mean, on like, my... What is there to say? Uh, Link vs. Cloud was on my last, uh, what was it, 2019 uh, top 10 list. So... I mean... Uh, I mean, like, what is there to say here? It seems like Cloud's just going to get the win he should have gotten a long time ago. Maybe? Again, I'm curious to see how it goes. But this is the first uh, rematch in a long time. I wonder if they're going to hire a guy to have Link grunt around, or if it's going to be voice clips. <laughs> they seem to hire people for literally everything, but they, they totally anyway, don't just I'm use gonna, voice clips. I'm going to review the episode based on my first impressions, and this is in the first spoiler chat. Alright. Um, anyway, I, I guess that's it for the episode. Do you have something yeah. to say, Hyper? I, I guess... I guess, uh... I guess, like, it, it went by a bit too fast. It went by a bit too fast, but it, other it, than it that... Didn't, it didn't linger on the characters that much. Like, the, the entire thing felt short because the entire thing was nothing but numbers. But uh, The creator of Star Versus retweeted the DB. Dang. Of course they would. Now we just need <laughs> Rebecca Sugar to get on this. Rebecca Sugar will probably never fucking retweet this. <laughs> no, uh, no, no, Rebecca's yeah. gonna be like, there We're... wasn't enough genocide. <laughs> but it would be the opposite. I know. All right, well, <laughs> okay, if you guys like this, if you guys like this reaction, you can like it. If you didn't, dislike. But either way, we'll see all of you in the next video making a giant assumption that he is the literal size of a galaxy, which I don't like. <laughs> well, you see, counter-argument, you're dumb and a poopy head, and we're right, uh, so shut all up. Alright, but you're <laughs> <laughs> bleep, bleep it out. Bleep red, red. I am yeah. asking you to bleep it out to make it so much worse. That is going to be so much worse if I bleep it out, but yes. <laughs> Thank you. I'm going Let's to leave this over. conversation in after the fact, though, just so they know. <laughs> Awesome, I'm going to get cancelled. <laughs>